Here we have the Kai Wheats HT206D digital clamp meter. This is really nice clamp meter. Honestly, I just got it for the multimeter, but having that clamp has been really handy. It's a, it's a nice size. It's about the size of probably a Nokia 5110 if you're familiar with older mobile phones. Um, maybe just slightly bigger than that, slightly longer, but it feels really good in hand. It's, it's nice and small, easy to operate. One finger for the clamp. Um, you have all of your different options here on the switch. And your inputs on the bottom. And it's got a nice screen. And for the voltage setting, it will automatically switch between uh, like volts and millivolts and whatnot. You don't have to actually select that yourself, which is always really handy. Now it comes in this awesome carry case. You've got your user manual inside. Then you have standard leads. So I'm sure you know how these work. Pop those out, pop them into the bottom of the unit. And then on this end, if I can get that to focus, let's see, Ooh. here we go. So it's just a standard uh, tip on the end there, but if you remove this part, then you get the extra long piece, which is really handy. And a lot of people don't realize that these come off, but yeah, they do. And you'll get that on most multimeters, but look, it's a really nice um, sort of pen feel on the end. It's a little bit rubberized, so it's not going to slip out of your grip. It's not that cheap plastic. It's slightly rubberized, which is just, you know, it's the little things. It's nice. And then, of course, you have your temperature sensor. So this just plugs into the bottom and then put this where you need your temperature reading. Always good to have these. And again, a lot of people don't understand what these are for, but this is for temperature. And then this didn't actually come with it, but it's something I always chuck in. It's handy to have a paperclip, just if you're trying to get to some really hard to reach contacts, shove a paperclip down in there and then touch this instead and you're good to go. But yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it. If you're looking at one of these, you already know what you're going to use it for, I imagine. I don't need to explain what all of the different settings do, but this works really well. Um, I've found it's quite accurate and it's been running now for phew, probably a good, good couple of years and the battery hasn't run out, which is excellent. Yeah, highly recommended. Enjoy. Enjoy.